hopefully what'll be a Act record setting crowd. Now tickets are still available. They can yeah. still a few tickets, straggling tickets available. Like yeah. You don't have to buy them from a big guy named Biff outside that says I need two. Okay. Need <laughs> tickets here. Tickets are still available. BJ yeah. Burton's called me four times this morning already to make All sure right. I say that. So right. tickets are still available. Well, yeah. He didn't call just for Despite a hug. Despite the rumors, no. Like good morning <laughs> or something. You know? No, he oh, never no? gives me a yeah. hug. Yeah. Um, yeah. One eight hundred five big red is the number to call. All right. One eight hundred five big red, and yeah. uh, it should be great. We we got a chance to work out there last night. The ballpark's yeah. in great shape. It's beautiful. Right now, um, you guys got a pretty nice little ballpark too over there. You know, we do, yeah, we do. You know, we had two thousand uh, last Wednesday night for the Louisville game at home. Great right. crowds, and uh, we're so appreciative of everybody yeah. coming out and supporting us. This uh, team just keeps getting better and better and better. The baseball program, you've uh, you're doing um doing great work there. I know the players are uh, a lot of that too. Great team this year, nationally ranked. Um, now, were you guys were you guys ranked at all last year at all, or near the end of the year maybe? The la the final rankings we were 23. Yeah, yeah. We were in the top 25. So in the final yeah. rankings, that was the first time all year. Wow. Now, when was the last time the uh, baseball program was at the heights that you have taken it to? Can you, I couldn't tell uh, you. Those the history books. Yeah. I couldn't tell you. 1927, actually, when all they right. had about oh Hulahan, oh Hulahan. It was uh, Irish, Irish influence on the team at that time. They uh, they ran a lot uh, that time. Uh, this year's team, though, a lot of great players on this team. That Rice kid's pretty good, right? Yeah, Matt Rice is yeah. a heck of a player. He's an All-American catcher for us. Uh, Matt Payton, a senior infielder. Right. Second baseman's having an unbelievable year for us. So right. he's a, and do you recruit only Matt's? Yeah, I'm Matt. Sorry. We got a bunch of Matt's. Yeah, yeah, we got a easy. bunch of Matt's. Yeah. I say Matty, and yeah. about five guys turn around, including yeah. our pitching coach. So, yeah. Uh, but that's a real good team, though. Uh, and, of course, uh, the, the just – you know, good players almost breed good players in the program. We just had a chance. Uh, we'll talk a little bit more. Speaking of playing at the at the Bowling Green Ballpark this last weekend, former Hilltopper, uh, uh, Wade, uh, Wade Gainer was there. Yeah. Did you get a chance to catch up with him? Yeah, he town? stopped by. We were yeah. uh, he stopped by Wednesday when they got in town, and uh, yeah. we visited for a while. And then, of course, yeah. we were leaving, so we didn't get a chance to see him play. We'll see him next time he gets in town. Though. Yeah. Great kid. Uh, great kid. And of course, the, you guys on fire this year. Uh, great, uh, great team uh, today against Kentucky. Now, what, what do we need about Kentucky Wildcat baseball? Everybody talking basketball in right. Kentucky, uh, football even. But yeah. what about this baseball no, they're team? Good. They're pretty good, right? Yeah, they're very good. You know, they've yeah. been in the top 30 most of the year. And, right. uh, you know, it was a heck of a game up there. We scored a couple late to make it 6 3, but they got a really yeah. good ball club, and it, it'll be a competitive game. Right. Uh, usually are. So we've beaten them up at their place the last two years, so I'm sure they're. Want to get some payback down here. Right. Well, it's going to be a big game. 1 800 5 Big Red for your tickets. WKUSports.com. And they can uh, they can take a shot at getting some at the door, I guess. But might not be the best idea. They want to go ahead and get them, I guess. Yeah. Right? You know what's great? I, I've had probably 20 different people talk about the tailgating that's going to go on before our baseball yeah. game. Yeah. Well, we're going to be out there. And that's, station that, I know. And that's yeah. just awesome. You know, four five years ago when we couldn't yeah. even get 100 people to come to one of our games. Wow. And now we're talking about maybe, you know, four or 5,000 and tailgating yeah. for the game. It's very gratifying. It says a lot about all the hard work people put into baseball in this town. I think the hot rod's got a lot to do with it. Yeah, well, baseball definitely is. It, it, well, I think you guys have a lot to do with that, too. I mean, I think you're having a winning program. And the thing is, too, you guys are getting out there in front of people. Uh, you know, the team's very available, you know, when you guys are in town, right. always available. And I think that yes, Hot Rod some influence there as well. But now, how long have you been uh, on the hill now? How long have you been? This is my fifth year. Fifth year. Yeah, yeah. So from day one when you rolled in five years ago to where you are today, um, I mean, I know you say, "Oh yeah, I really pictured us being here," but by the same token, it's almost a little humbling too, right? It it's, is. It's very. You know, when I look out yeah. there and see the crowds and see the right. people into it, just having fun, it's it's very gratifying. And yeah. it's not just about wins or losses, but you know, we yeah. we, we feel like we built a good program and people. Right. Are, are interested and they enjoy coming to the ballpark. That's what it's all about. It's entertainment after all. All right, now let's drop some names here because I know a lot of folks there heading out, you know, maybe to their first topper baseball yeah. game with it being such a big, uh, you know, interstate game here with Kentucky. Uh, let's drop some names. Who's going to be your pitcher today? Who's Brian Edelin will be our starting pitcher. He's a right. redshirt junior right-hander, right. and uh, he's he's beaten Vanderbilt this year. He's, right. he's been a guy that's thrown really good quality midweek game right. starts for so he started right. against Kentucky up there as gotcha well. now uh, now of course uh, we talked about Rice he's uh, yeah, Mr. Yeah, All-American right. there yeah. smart dude too. good looking yeah. guy Aaron yeah. I'm just saying 
Uh, All right, thanks, Tony. Yeah, we're trying to figure out the ball player. Uh, yeah. So he's one of your he's one of your studs there. Who yeah. else? Who is any of the guys yeah. who got a really sweet Matt, Matt Pegg's our lead off hitter, second baseman, yeah. uh, senior. Uh, Jake Wells, our first baseman, is another senior. We only got two senior position players. Wow, so, so that's even better right there. Yeah. It's like it's like the cupboard is not yeah. there. Right? Cass Carter is a sophomore center fielder for us who will be a yeah. very high draft pick next year. So right. he's a he's a guy that people want to watch and. That's a big ballpark, you know. We, yeah. uh, he'll be able to showcase his speed out there. He can make uh -huh. some some fun things happen tonight out there. On now, what, now, what are your adjustments going from uh, Nick Dennis Field to uh, the Bowling Green ballpark? Are there any, or you start yeah, to play the game? You know, the bases are still the same. Way. Yeah, they yeah. are. And and the field, we play in a big field, so we're kind of used to it. I wanted right. to see how the ball was going to carry last night, and it played really big, kind of like our field does. Right. Uh, right. So, not a big adjustment there. Uh, Kentucky will probably have a bigger adjustment because their park's a little smaller. Really? Uh, but if the you know if the wind's blowing like it was last night, it's going to play big. There might not be a lot of home runs hit tonight. Right. Now on the year, you guys still doing good. Still got a lot of chances even after today though to go see the top or baseball team in action. Uh, a lot of home games left on the schedule. They can still get their tickets right. One eight hundred five big red. Very yeah. affordable, right? Yeah, yeah. You know, twenty five dollars was a season ticket package, which yeah. is. Like seventy-eight cents a game, yeah. so that's not bad. <laughs> that's uh, that's cheaper than Netflix. <laughs> yeah, it's five bucks at the door. Yeah, so you might as well just buy the whole thing and you yeah. can give them away if you don't like it. But yeah. uh, we got three home weekends left after this. Right. Florida International this weekend, which we're tied with them in the Sun Belt. Right. Uh, and then we got uh, Arkansas Little Rock, and we finished with Middle Tennessee. Yeah, you guys don't uh, like that. Huge. No, I'm, no, I'm no, going to go on record and say that. that. Right. <laughs> Uh, right. Yeah, last year was a tarp gate. That's yeah, what they the call it, right? Gate. Yeah, you yeah. got you, you got to take the, the high road right. about that. But I can throw yeah. them under the deck of the bus, right. yeah. so I'll do that for you. Go ahead. Um, big yeah. game though tonight. What time do folks need to get there tonight? You think? Well, it's, it's general admission seating, so I think they're opening the gates at four. So right. I would get there because uh, I mean, right. once you know, it's it's first come first served on yeah. the seats. Uh, Unless you're one of the big wigs that gets up in the boxes. I don't so. know if that was like. Yeah, me neither. Uh, the odd thing is, our big wigs actually wear wigs, actually. Oh, they're, really? They're not only yeah, uh, they're customers, they're actually clients as well. <laughs> uh, so, anyway, can the kids come out and meet the players and stuff too? Available? Yeah, can they do uh, that? I'm sure. They haven't yeah. talked. Uh, usually we do, you know, yeah. after games. Those kids we'll have like the guys that, out there, absolutely. Yeah. And uh, our guys do a good job. It, that that yeah. place is such a fan friendly ballpark, I'm right. sure. While BP's going on, the kids come out there. Yeah. Our guys love them. Keep the foul balls, balls and the whole stuff too, Keep right? the foul balls, baby. Yeah. That's right. You got to do that, man. That keeps them coming back. Hey, Coach, I appreciate what you're doing up there on the hill uh, with the baseball team. It's good to have a winner out there. Thank you. And I think you guys are finally starting to get just a, a tad bit of the credit you guys deserve. It's really well, good to see what you guys too. have done. Uh, team is winning. They're looking good tonight, though. Probably one of the one of the biggest games, I guess, in your coaching career, right? Yeah, tonight, absolutely. Just atmosphere and everything. Yeah, I think so. This will be more yeah. like a – you know, a, a regional type atmosphere tonight, and yeah. uh, it's it's a good showcase because I, I told our guys, you never know yeah. when somebody's seeing you for the first time. Yeah, and you got to put, you got to, you got to want them to come back. Right. Well, I think it's going to be a great atmosphere tonight at the Bowling Green Ballpark. Now, one eight hundred five Big Red. Get your tickets. WKUSports.com. Uh, top for baseball in action tonight against the Kentucky Wildcat team. Now they're pretty good too, right? Now they're, they're, they're good. good. Yeah, yeah it's going to say, good. it's going to yeah. be a good game. Uh, so you're going to see the big blue in town tonight against our big red. It's going to be a, it's going to be an interesting crowd. Going to be a lot of colors yeah. going on there. Yeah, that's right. Uh, so uh, ch check it out tonight. Get there early. General admission seating, and of course, still got a couple more chances to see the Toppers at home at Nick Dennis Field this year as well. One eight hundred five Big Red WKUSports dot com for all your ticket information. Coach, good luck tonight. Okay, okay Tony. Thank there you. Eight thirty four, everybody. Appreciate Tony Rose Morning Show. One hundred point seven Sam FM. Thanks, Coach. Thanks, Appreciate man. Thank I got, so I got, I got to get you a new one. Hey, man. This is a uh, gift. Yeah. This this trickled down to me.